Hello, this is Leach83. How are we doing? Welcome to Season 2, Episode 14 now of Celtic's Road to European Cup and everything's going okay so far. Um, at the moment we've played 26 games and we are 10 points clear at the top of the league and we are also in the last 16 where we have our match against Chelsea. We won the first leg 1-0 and the second leg will actually not be up until next episode. This episode we'll get games against Motherwell and then against Aki's in the league and then we have got Aki's again in the Scottish Cup quarter final which is all well and good and then we'll start off um, the next episode with the round 16 clash against Chelsea so we'll keep it at three um, per episode and everything's going okay so Jack Gillis just signed a new contract with us as well so I might as well tell you that but the main important thing is obviously to get into this match against Motherwell now um, a league form lately hasn't been the best of all um, so we just need to try and get it back together when it comes to um, when it comes to this one um, so when it comes to obviously this game, we need to get back to winning ways, so um, I think we'll probably go with the same team, I don't think there was anybody who I didn't select who I would like to select, um, yeah, right, okay, we'll go with that, so it's Gordon and goals with Yanko, Boyata, Chester and Santos at the back, with Alan, Eswine, Grealish and Mackay Steven as our midfield, and then Ikenacho and Braithwaite up front, um, hopefully that should be an okay team to take care of Motherwell, um, so let's get into the game and see how we go. It's a good ball by Mackay Steven and he finds Martin Braithwaite, he gets through and we get a breakthrough for the first goal in the second half. It, we couldn't get through him at all in the first half but just a nice little pass through into the middle, little dink, getting lucky but Mackay Steven puts it through and Braithwaite sticks it away for 1-0. They're in the box, it's in the last minute! Oh my god, injury time! And they've come back it is and it's a going to finish as a draw. I can't believe it. The ball through. The defence is split apart again. Cross the ball and it's 1-0 right at the bloody death. Unbelievable. Melty bodies with you, that's very disappointing how that game's went down. We've had 8 shots with 6 on target, Mullow only had 1 shot on target right in the bloody 90th odd minute, um, which was just ridiculous, it's just a bit of a shame how it went down. Um, anyway, it's a 1-0 draw, it's another draw in the league, um, which is quite disappointing, and I really wanted to get back to winning ways, it's a bit, a bit really kind of how it went down, I've just a bit gutted, but anyway, what can you do? Um, we just need to kind of brush ourselves down and keep on with it and get rocking for our next game. So do the usual, get the players in for training and get the squad ready for our next game against Hamilton Ackies. Okay, so here we are ready to get into the second game of the episode. Um, away to Hamilton Ackies. We're going with more or less the same team. Um, it's just Ryan Christie coming in in replace of Mackay Steven. So let's see how we go on. Let's try our best here to get back to winning ways. Alan plays the ball through. For Martin Braithwaite, he's got Ryan Christie with him, Christie back to Braithwaite, get a chance to run at the Hamilton defence, shot, keeper saves and it falls for Christie, I'll take it, I don't care how we get them, 80th minute, Ryan Christie following in the Braithwaite shot and that'll do nicely to give us a 1-0 lead, first chance we've had to properly run at them like that and it's 1-0, well not the prettiest of games at all but we'll take it, it's a 1-0 win. Hamilton only having one shot on target, and one shot completely. We had 11 shots, 7 of them on target. We definitely dominated the game with 6 corners as well, but unfortunately only getting one goal. But I'm not bored with that. It's 3 points, and it's back to winning ways, just like I wanted. So that's the main thing. So, the next game is of course against Hamilton Ackies again, this time in the Scottish Cup quarter final. So we'll get the team ready for that. We're making a couple of changes for it, and we'll see how we go. Okay, so here we are ready for a game against Ackies in the Cup quarter final now, this time. And we've went with a much changed team. It's Julian and goals with Lustig, Duffy, Morrison and Tierney at the back. With Brown at the centre defensive mid. The rest of the midfield is McLean with Desa and McGregor. And then up front is Marvin Emnes and J. Emmanuel Thomas. Getting a rare run out for the squad. But we may as well use them in this cup game. So, let's see how we go. Hopefully we can progress. McGregor pokes that through. Scott Brown running on it out of all people. Brown! Oh, doing nicely. It's 1-0. <laughs> Scott Brown making a rare run into the box, but it's a nice play. Cal McGregor getting away from the tackle. Nice ball through, and Brown slots it away for 1 0. Nobody attacking it. McLean picks the ball up. 
Nothing doing. McLean first time. Manuel Thomas. In this. That's there. It's 2 0. A bit scrappy, but I don't give a shit. I'll take it. It's 2 0 now. Naki's defenders are pretty disconsolate. The ball back out to McLean. Pops it up, and it falls in the end for Emnes to head it into the net and make it 2 0. Emmanuel Thomas strong on the ball. Very strong on the ball. Nips it through for McGregor. Oh, lovely first time shot. Callum McGregor makes it 3 0. Two quick fire goals. The work and the strength done by Emmanuel Thomas there. Getting the ball through and McGregor able to smash it. That will do nicely. Very nice run. Lovely through ball and a first time hit. And it's 3 0. And Nezel got into that loose ball. Chance for a to burst into the box, which he does do. <laughs> it's deflected, it's a terrible goal. It really is bad from Naki's point of view. Um, <laughs> shouldn't celebrate, shouldn't even laugh. It's just typical way the kind of bullshit you get in this game at times. Running through the defenders pretty simply and then just having a little pop. Hits off the defender and off the bar, that will do. And it is That's a 4 0 result. It is a 4 0 victory in the Cup quarter final, which is absolutely perfect. Team played very well. Scott Brown back in the starting 11 made a very big difference to us, popping up with a goal as well. As you can see, we dominated the game. Not much in possession, but the most chances, uh, the most uh, created attempts, that's all that really matters and all we can really ask for. So, in this episode, then a draw in the league and then a win against Hamilton and then a win against Hamilton in the Cup is a good way to go. And hopefully we can keep winning ways going when we start the next episode with that very important game against Chelsea. Obviously we're 1-0 up at the moment, um, but it's all going to come down to whether we can stay strong in that game to progress in the Champions Cup or as we say, the Champions League. So, that will bring an end to this episode. I hope you have enjoyed. If you have, then smash a like as always and I'll catch you in the next one. Take it easy.